Protecting freedom is second nature to the Buckners. They are a family with Kansas City ties whose lineage has touched almost every single American war. Beth Vaughn introduces us. A quiet cemetery in northern Kentucky is home to valuable American history. This is Simon Bolivar Buckner Jr.'s gravesite. A World War II general laid to rest next to a Confederate officer with the same name. The two are son and father. Both of them of two totally different eras. Uh, just that type of military accomplishment and family accomplishment uh, is, is pretty fantastic. But that's not where the story ends or where it begins. Kansas City's William Buckner will fill you in. And my father was in World War II and in World War I. Are you taking notes? His father was in the Civil War and the Mexican War, and his father was in the uh, War of 1812. You guessed it, there's more. His uh, father-in-law was uh, in the Revolutionary War. Buckner served in the Army for 28 years, too. Today, his home is decorated with military pictures and artifacts from generations of service. Delivered to General Buckner. This letter, handwritten by President Lincoln, is one he'll pass down to his son, Simon Bolivar Buckner IV, great-grandson to a man who chose to fight for the South. Because of the length of time and the number of people involved, we have lots of family stories we can tell, and it sort of gives us a root in an insight into who we are and where we came from. A rich history of service to the United States of America. Of course I'm proud. Of course. That both men feel humbled to continue. Well, you may be asking, is there a Simon Bolivar Buckner the fifth? Well, yes, he's growing up right here in Kansas City. And there's no word, though, on if they choose to follow in his family's footsteps. Mm.